So the idea is to create a small uh, AUKAD piece by simulation of a small RC circuit to create a small uh, frequency analysis of this piece of circuit. This is uh, AUKAD CIS version 16.6 and I've, re I've just started it so the first thing to do is to create a new project file a new project and give this name this a, a fitting name so I will call this uh, AC analysis I will save it in my location users KNN orchid and I will make this an analog or mixed AD simulation project that will do for now okay I will create this upon a blank project okay and here we go so I want to create a small RC circuit um, and right now here is the page showing my circuit schematic page I have also something called a design uh, tab showing design resources and whatever is connected to this piece of system in here I have the schematic page one which refers to this piece of schematic so I'll uh, put on some components to the right side here I have uh, a small picture called place part if I press this I'm able to look for different parts um, when I'm looking for a part if I'm looking for a resistor I'll press R for resistor and I can see I have different versions of R so R is available in different version and this has to do with different libraries down here are the different libraries right now I have highlighted R slash discrete so this comes from the discrete library if I press the next one R analog I can see that two symbols are coming up here these indicate that this specific resistor can do piece by simulation and it can also do it can also be used for layout of printed circuit boards so I will want to run with this uh, R this resistor so what I do is if I press return I'll be able to place my resistor in my circuit schematic there it goes there's a yellow marking saying that I haven't given or saying that I can't put two resistors right on top of each other pressing escape will let go so I want to place a capacitor as well going for C and the same thing I have the discrete uh, library with no uh, options for uh, for simulation but I have my analog component down here which will allow simulation uh, so I want to go for this one press return and uh, control R will return will rotate my my capacitor so I'll place my capacitor like this escape to let go um, to do a simulation of this I need to pl place an AC voltage generator and this is called VAC this is available in the source library and this will also do for simulation so I want to place this and I want to place it over here somewhere escape I want to zoom in on these components if I mark them I have an option to zoom into uh, all uh, zoom into all I can I can just use my plus and zoom into my component and here we are um, 
To connect these components, I need to place wires, which is over here. Place wire. This, like this, this, and this, this, and this. Um, if I want to tidy things up a bit, I press escape to let go the place wire thing. Then I mark uh, this one and I can pull it down a bit like this. And I can mark this piece of wire and pull it up a bit like this. Um, to make a simulation now, I, I need to put in a ground. Um, so on my right side here, I have something called place ground. And I have different versions of ground power ground uh, and different signal ground. I haven't really got the clue of this, but I know that if I choose the top one, zero slash capsim, this seems to be working for me. So I'll place it like this and escape to let go. So now I'm ready for a simulation. The um, next thing to do is, I think I have to save my document. And then to do a simulation, I go to P Spice and I go to New Simulation Profile, where I'll tell what kind of simulation I'm going to do. This is a this is an AC uh, simulation I'm creating now. There, this is the name for that. Create, and next thing is. Uh, in the P spice, I have something called edit simulation profile. No. Ah, when I created the simulation, it, it opened a tab over here, and right now it's actually opened two of these tabs. So I, I think I'll close one of them and look at the other one. It's right there. And what I want to create now is I want to create an AC simulation, so that goes, the analysis type is AC sweep slash noise. I want to create a logarithmic uh, simulation. My components are 1K and I don't remember. Uh, so I'll do something like a start frequency of uh, 1K and an end frequency of 1 mega uh, and I'll do like uh, 10 points for each decade and I'll go OK for that. I have to see what are the actual components. 1 nano. OK. So now the simulation is kind of set up and all I need to do now is to run the simulation. Um, and that's done like go to P Spice and press run. It will open a new picture down here. And I have some uh, problems here. I have some errors. There's an error here. It says something like the AC analysis directive goes. And I can recognize this. This is 10 point for a dec for each decade going from 1K to 1 mega. And I guess the 1 mega is not readable for this. So what I will do is I will go back to my P Spice uh, simulation profile and the end uh, frequency I really mean 1 mega but I'll write it like 1000 kilo and I guess this will work so I go piece by and I will run go for my results and no outputs but no errors so the idea is that you put that in this uh, plot you put in a trace showing what you want to see. So I go trace and add trace. 
and what I really want to see going back to the schematic is the voltage across C1 so going back to the simulation I want to see the voltage across C1 um, I don't want to see anything about current powers or alias names I want to see the voltage on C1 which is this actual component if I go OK uh, this is not what I want Uh, what happened there? Trace, add trace, VC1. I guess when it shows me these close to nothing numbers, it's probably because I'm on the wrong end of this. So I go VC1, but end 2. And then I go OK, and there you go. So at VC1, but pin number 2, I can see the voltage is starting from 1 kHz at 1 volts and at around uh, 0, 0 0.7, at, at around uh, between 1 and 300, that's 150K. I'll have a 3 decibel crossover frequency, I guess, and otherwise it'll go down towards the 1 megahertz. This is the first version of the show up. Um, there will be more videos showing these things. Goodbye for now.